everyone, welcome back to another video. Um, so today I'm gonna to bring you on a vlog up in London. It's actually Mother's Day today, so um, me and my mum are going for brunch and then we're gonna go shopping down King's Road. Um, so I'm actually in the station at the moment, just waiting for her to arrive. Um, what I'm gonna do after this, like, I'm gonna insert a clip of me using the new NARS foundation, um, cause that's what I've got on my skin at the moment. And I really like it actually, I've used it a couple of times now, so I'll just insert a clip of me using that um as i did say i was gonna do a trial of it but um, then i'll show you what we're doing for the rest of the day bye and then do a left what do you, yeah, because well, yeah, we're walking this way. We should have walked. Hi everyone, so we're just on our way to um, Kings Road now. We've had me and mum, or mum and I have had a bit of a disaster. Not a disaster, it's mainly a disaster on my part because I'm so fussy and can't find anything I want to eat in either of the menus that I looked up. So note yourself, don't just look at somewhere that looks pretty on Instagram, actually look at the food. So that's just like the dilemma we're having now. But by the time we get to the Kings Road anyway, it'll be bloody lunchtime. So the brunch we was meant to come out for will now be lunch. Um, so yes, we're just walking through Carnaby Street. Oh gosh, a bit of drama going on in Carnaby Street. Never seen such a big queue outside a Swatch shop. Um, so yeah, um, we, we will keep you up to date. We're gonna go and get some stuff from Zara as well. I think that man was laughing at me because I went, I went, I went, I went, I went, I've seen such a bit, uh, so much drama outside a Swatch shop. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'll keep you posted, but so far, it has been quite eventful in our oh, it's been very hour nice. that we've been through because I can't find anywhere I like to be. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll keep you posted. We're now in Kings Road, still struggling to find somewhere to eat because of because of me. Um, but we're going to try this Lebanese place, see what the menu's like. If not, because some of the places I've been looking at look nice, but they're just ages away. Like they look close on the map, and then you look at it, and it's like three miles away. And I think we've just got the tube past there. I don't know why it's been so stressful. Normally, it's really not that hard to find somewhere to eat. But I'm um, going to have a look at this place and see what it looks like. Oh, what about Black Penny? All day dining. If not, we could have a look at that menu. Right, let's just have a look at this menu because you've always wanted to eat here. Oh, I don't mind. I don't mind. Whatever you want to. Right, go on, have a look. Oh, yeah, falafel, like falafel. What am I looking So these are the Lululemon and Align shorts. I've always wanted a pair, but I just don't know if I need them, but they are so nice. Like they fit so nice. They're also never ever in stock, so I'm really surprised these are a size two. I think, yeah, so they're like a UK size six. Mm. I just grabbed a sports bra, I'm not going to get the sports bra, but just to see what they look like. And they are nice. What are we thinking of these sunglasses? Thank you. 
Absolutely. So I'm gonna get these Prada sunglasses, which I actually think are really cool. I think they'll be really nice for Mykonos. Um, and just the holidays I'm going on, and they are just trying to get me a new pair at the moment, but they're struggling to find them. So these are the tortoiseshell ones, but they also come in black, um, but I do quite like the tortoiseshell, so hopefully they have them in stock. Um, just because they look really nice. I feel like you're really zoomed in. Oh, you are really zoomed in, that's why. This is what the sunglasses look like. So sadly they didn't have my sunglasses in stock. They didn't have a brand new pair and I really didn't want to buy the ones that were on the shelf because they were already a bit scratched and had like stuff in them. Um, but I have ordered them and they literally arrived at Waitrose tomorrow. But I got them in black rather than the sort of shell but um, I'm still really happy with them. Um, but you know I'm just a bit annoyed because I wanted them like kind of there and then but they literally come tomorrow so that is really good and it's not like I'm going to wear them between now and then. I just wanted to get a few pictures in them but you know I'll still have them for my holidays so that's absolutely fine. Um, I'm just now looking for a retinal. Um, where is Are we going to Dermalogica? Yeah I just can't. I just yeah. can't. So we're just trying to find it, but we have had a really successful day shopping. Got my Lily Lemon leggings, and we're still going to go to and other stories. But um, and I got my sunglasses, and I literally can't wait for them to arrive. I am obsessed with them. So, so yeah. Um, so I went into Sunglasses Hat just to try on the sunglasses, um, but obviously I've ordered them now, and like they are basically the ones I tried on just black rather than tortoise shell. And the lady was saying how quickly they go. She was like, they're such an old style, but like they go so quickly. Um, so yeah, I'm really happy. I got some. I managed to get some. I mean, on John Lewis, it did say there was only two pairs left, so I was literally like ordering them there and then in the store. But. Um, yeah, I didn't realise that they were that hard to get. So I'm one excited and one chuffed with my purchase. Um, we're just currently having a little walk round. I think we're going to head back in a bit. Um, but it's a really nice day actually. The sun has finally come out. So it's quite nice. Maybe down there, it's quite sunny down there. Okay. Do you think? Yeah. Jan, that's a bit ugly. No. Yeah, so now it's nice and sunny. All the street. Mm, don't know how that looks Hey, so I thought I'd just do a quick haul and uh, just to show you what I've got today. Um, so this is the first thing, this t-shirt from Zara with the um, padded shoulders. I really like this actually, just with jeans or I've actually got some trousers that I bought that it actually looks really nice with. Thought it just kind of looks nice, a bit more interesting than a normal t-shirt. Um, so yeah, I'm going to pop it on with some cream trousers. So this is obviously quite a casual outfit, but if I put it on with the trousers, it kind of goes into a lot more of a worky outfit. This is the t-shirt with, sorry, mum is just unpacking her files in the background. Um, so this is a t-shirt with these new trousers that I got. Um, this is what I'd more wear to work. These are actually really nice, these trousers. I've had these before, but these are in a cream. Um, they're really flattering actually. Um, and I've got these in an extra small and the top is in a small. Um, but yeah, I think this is just a really nice outfit. I also could feel like I would wear this out with trainers, maybe. Like, if I was going out and wanted to wear something a bit smarter. Or, obviously, you could put the trousers with blouse. Um, but yeah, both really nice looks. And the next thing I've got is this orange top, which I thought would I would pair with these Zara shorts, which are actually quite old now. But I'm pretty sure they bring them out, like, most years. Or even in the shop, I did try this on with a similar pair so you can always get something a bit like it but I thought this was lovely for holiday um you know like with some heels obviously I've got my slippers on at the moment with some heels or something like that I got it for holiday I thought it'd be really nice when I got a tan and everything like that but I think it's super cute with like the frilly the frilly sleeves and just a nice colour um and just with the white shorts or even denim shorts or I literally could like wear it with jeans in the spring summer as well if you're going out for an evening um so yeah I thought it was just Holiday inspired again is this dress, super nice, it's actually slightly choking me at the moment because I've done it out too tight but just to show you what it looks like, I mean this gives you the effect, um, but it's a really nice red and then it's got like sort of like these flowers embroidered on it, um, but again I thought this would look really nice with some heels on holiday. Lastly I got this swimming, um, which is the last thing I got from Zara, really nice black, just nice wearable swimming costume really. Um, 
And the last um, clothing item that I got, which is probably my favourite the thing I'm most excited about, is the Lululemon Align 6 inch shorts. So nice. Like literally such nice shorts. Um, honestly, the Align collection is just the best thing ever. I wanted these shorts for such a long time, but they're so hard to get hold of. They're always out of stock. I'm going to keep these on now because they're just so comfortable. They're just so nice. So I'm actually so happy I managed to get these. I don't know how much I explained when we was out, but I did get the Prada sunglasses, which I'm really, really happy with. They are so nice. Um, but they didn't have them in store, like a new pair in stock. They only had the display pair, which I didn't really want just because they'd literally had like a few scratches over them and stuff like that. And I was like, I just wanted a new pair really. Especially as I don't need them like straight away. I don't really, like, I'm not in desperate need for them. So I was like, I just ordered them online. Literally got them ordered to wait shows for tomorrow. So, so, so quick. Um, so I don't have to wait long at all. Um, I actually ordered them in the black rather than the tortoise shell because they didn't have the tortoise shell online. Um, so yeah, but I'm still really happy with them. They're the ones I actually originally saw. So yeah, that's all good with me. Um, and then lastly, from Dermalogica, we've got um, a serum for my scarring and sort of breakout. So it's called an active clear, or the retinal clearing oil. Um, so it's got some retinol in it, like 0.5%, but then also different things that are help that are meant to help sort of like prevent breakouts as well so it's meant to be really good for like sort of dealing with the scar and stuff like that which is something i am trying to combat at the moment so really a successful day shopping i'm very pleased with all my purchases i'm currently going to stay in my little lemon shorts i'm obsessed with them they're so nice they were 38 pounds as well that actually wasn't as bad as what i thought it was going to be like it's the same price as like if you was going to buy them really on gymshark or whatever but um oh my god yeah i love them so much they're just their leggings their stuff is just so worth the money i did try and look at their jackets that are really popular on tiktok as well like the people that like them like the bbl jacket or whatever um but they literally would like they did have some but they had like quite bright colors there was like a nice gray one but they just didn't have any like smaller sizes in them so i mean it was literally 100 pounds so i probably wouldn't have got it anyway but um i did want to try on but never mind um so yeah i'm really really happy with my purchases i'm now just gonna watch some youtube take off my makeup and try out this new serum so i'll let you know how it goes also update on the um nars foundation so this is in natural daylight i think it's such a nice foundation like it's wore really nicely bearing in mind i've got like normal to oily skin um like a little bit oily coming through but nothing like horrific so it has lasted really really well i actually think my skin still looks really nice so i definitely will be getting a full um full size and obviously this is my natural skin colour and it matches quite well with that so yeah I'm really happy with that but I'm going to take my makeup off now because I am desperate to get it off also quite hungry so yeah I'll let you know what I'm doing next